So my mom used to tell me I used to dance all the time. Like grocery store, it was my stage down the aisle. I would turn and it did, probably didn't look good, but that's, I started as soon as I could walk, that's all I did. When we moved from New Jersey to South Carolina, they offered dance in school instead of PE. And I was like, this is my moment. Cause my mom was a single mom, so she couldn't afford to like pay for company lessons. So I was like, oh yeah, now's my time. So I started officially like in the sixth grade and I danced until I was in ninth grade. Then I stopped because I started playing sports. I had fun, but it was like, you know, it was like a realization moment for me. It was like my talent level there just isn't, it's more for fun than it is for anything that's gonna be serious. So I just stopped playing sports and I came back to dance when I got to college. I think it's because where my heart has always been. Um, and it's something that I was always really good at. And honestly, I did not think I was gonna come to college. I applied to USC Columbia and I was like, hopefully I get in. That was the only school I applied to. And my mom was like, no, no. And then um, she kept setting up tours for schools and was like, well, let's go to Francis Marion and let's go to USC Beaufort. And I was like, oh, well, let me try USC Aiken. <laughs> and then I actually got accepted. And when I was here for like my orientation, they're like, well, what are you interested in? And I was like, I don't know. And my mom was like, well, she used to dance when she was in high school. And he's like, we have a dance team. Here, I'll give you the person's email. And then I tried out. I feel like it's a way to express myself without having to talk. But it's something like I can put all my energy into. It's like I get that like relief from stress and all that.